Right, so for those waiting for a mini LED Apple display to launch, there is some bad news because production for these have been delayed and we might not see a WWDC release as initially rumoured. And so let's delve into it guys, but first, make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumours. And with that being said, let's just talk in. So the ever credible Ross Young tells us the 27 inch Apple display that was in the works has been delayed due to the Shanghai lockdown and the fact that of course the manufacturer of these was going to be Quanta Inc based in China. And so right now they're in the process of moving production to a different location but of course that's going to take some time and so as a result the release is now going to be in October instead. Now that is a pretty major delay, but of course, Apple can go about two ways when it comes to the release of this display. So the first one is pretty simple, which is releasing this at the October Mac event, where we could expect to see other Mac products. And yeah, I'm pretty confident we're going to see an October Mac event, since that did happen last year for the MacBook Pros, and with many M2 Macs in the works, I can see some of those releasing at an October event. And so yeah, alongside these Macs, we could see the release of this mini LED Apple display. However, there is of course another possibility which is, Apple announces the display at DubDub, but makes it available to buy later in the year. And yeah, I do think there's a very strong chance Apple does this because in the past, when it comes to their pro products, Apple's pretty comfortable showing it off months before it's available to buy. For example, the 2019 Mac Pro was only available to buy in December, but of course, we knew everything about it and it was unveiled at DubDub. And of course, alongside the Mac Pro, the Pro Display XDR was unveiled. And so similar to that, I can see Apple giving us a preview of the mini LED Apple display, but also, of course, the Mac Pro with Apple Silicon. So yeah, this news, in my opinion, does not mean we're definitely not going to see hardware at DubDub. I do still think that's a possibility, but the products might not immediately be available to buy. Anyways, those are the details, guys. But tell me in the comments below, do you think Apple is going to release this display at DubDub? Anyways, thank you for watching, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumors. Check out the link above on details regarding the iPhone 14 series. And on that note, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya, peeps.